Hey all, and welcome to Ninja Bill Reviews, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Authentics Alpha Class Megatron, and the Bravo Class Megatron. I got them both. Oh, and I might as well just throw him in the review as well, um, why not? Um, this, look, this line is, is really, really basic, really basic, uh, um, although my friend Drew made an awesome absolutely tremendous i'll see if i can get that image and include it below i'll link to uh, leave a link to his facebook if i do it it may not be in the video I, I i'm not sure it depends on how much time i have uh, um i got family staying here now uh, um due to everything that's been going on in the real world you know uh, um things are changing they lost their home and they're staying here now so there's been a lot going on that's why i haven't done any videos since i got back why I haven't got a lot of things shipped out yet. I've got to get all these things done, but I've been so, so busy with life because life has been getting in the way. Anyway, this is him. And this is his tank mode, and it's not a bad tank mode by all means. It's not terrible. I've seen better. I've seen worse. And he looks pretty good. He does. I think he looks pretty good in his tank mode. Got these big blast panels or something on the side there. It's got some nice molded details in there. Got some nice molded detail on those treads. Yes, they lack for paint, but, you know, there it is. There's the bottom. There's the top. This keeps moving on me. Doesn't really tab into place. And the cannon does move down slightly up because of, there's a lot of kibble underneath there. So, you know, at least you get down, not much up. Now, maybe if I reverse the cannon, it could go up more. I don't know. But there's him. Quick comparison. There he is. With This is the Alpha. This is the Bravo. And, yeah, that's... He's... This one is... Get him off the screen. Just a smaller version. Got some purple right there for that Decepticon symbol. This one doesn't have one at all. And you'll note. So, at least... Yeah, it's, no, it's nowhere to be seen. Huh, didn't notice that before. But this one actually has one molded in right there. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. And it does have it on the other side too. Nope, just that one side. Oh, but this is the Bravo one. And like the uh, this one actually has some nice up, some down. This one actually has a bit more articulation. See his head sitting right there. There's the front, side, top, and pretty much, yeah, they're pretty much, you know, identical in many respects, except for, you know, he hides his head better. So, uh, quick transformation, it's fairly simple. What you want to do is move out these panels a little bit. You want to undo these arms so you can take this cannon off. I know parts forming, but there it is. Take that off. Get the arms up out of the way so you can then untab. There is a tab right there. Untab that. Bring out that leg. Do the same thing on this side. Gotta get that arm up out of the way. Untab it. Swing that leg out. Swing this leg down. Swing this leg down. And there you go. Swing out this arm. Boom. Swing out this arm. Boom. Done. And you got his head right there. Take his cannon and either a port on this side or a port on this side. We all know this is where the cannon goes. You can have it that way or you can have it that way. Depends on your tastes. But there is the Bravo class Megatron. He's like a Legends class, okay? That's the Bravo. This is the Alpha. He transforms in the same way. Gonna go ahead and remove that cannon. Get that out of the way. This is... They each have just that one accessory. His is done in that gray. This one is done in the black. And once we get those, those arms up out of the way, we want to go ahead and get these arms. Oh, I forgot to tab in down here. Untab it. Untab it. Get these arms up out of the way. Because you got to swing. Untab there. There's a slot. There's a tab right there. You can see that. Slot. Tab. Move that out. Same on this side. Get that up out of the way. Untab. There is, once again, it's tabbed in right there. Just untab that. Boom. Just like that. Swing those feet around. Swing those feet around. 
whoops, <laughs> on this one you gotta actually swing the waist around, move those arms into position. This one's being a little, little more finicky. Those elbow joints on mine, ball joints are pretty tight. There we go. Go ahead and pull this chest down, flip up the head. Mine it gets stuck. There we go. Boom. And then once again, you can have it on either arm, but we all know Megatron needs it on his right arm. And there you go. There are those two together. He's about a vo current Voyager scale. He is a le old legend scale. Pretty cool. All in all, pretty cool. we will raise up my camera here so we can take a proper look at him. We'll start with the Alpha Megatron. And there he is. And he's got a nice head. A little zoom in. Red eyes. Silver face. Nice head sculpt. There's a Septicon symbol. Got some red there. Some silver. Some black. Some red. I should say. Lots of molded detail otherwise. Black paint right there. Got some silver and black paint right there. Some silver go. Oh no, I guess not. Pretty clean back. I mean, you know, for the price you pay for these guys, it ain't bad. Here is the Bravo. Oh, cuss. There we go. Nice bright red eyes, almost orange, I think. Silver. Let's get a nice head sculpt. Septicon symbol looks beat up. I <laughs> got some other stuff going on. But otherwise, he's pretty cool. I think he's pretty cool. I, I dig him. I dig him a lot. I dig him. And finally, we're going to take a look at the Starscream. And this is oh, absolutely the most horrible Starscream. I, you know what? I thought the first uh, uh, Starscream uh, uh, alt mode in the Cyberverse was horrible uh, until I saw this. <laughs> I think I didn't think it could get any worse until I saw this. <laughs> Cause that's pretty much all the robot. <laughs> all the robot. No attempts to hide it whatsoever. <laughs> it's just Yeah. Yeah, it is what it is. Got a little bit of paint there on the wings. Septicon symbol. And that is a raised symbol. So transform them you want to go ahead and flip this cockpit over just like that here comes the tricky part of mine getting this head up Urgh. gonna pull that head up and it doesn't like to pull up all the way <clears throat> be right back yeah i can't get that head up all the way my, my fingers are just too big to reach in here and pull that up all the way because it needs to go up more there's nothing else really there except for you to pull up Oh, oh, there I got it. There I got it. There is. There's his head. And it's okay. Anyway, I'll show that more. Go ahead and untab the arms. Pull those up. And you can take these off. And his cannons look pretty cool. And you put those on his arms. Just like so. I wish they could go on his shoulders, but they don't. I'm going to go ahead and remove this one. Remove it. There we go. Pull the shoulders up. Once you've untabbed it, I just forced it out of there. Doesn't really matter. Go ahead and flip up, untab. Tabs in back here. Flip those wings up. Tab, slot. Boom. Done like that. Untab his legs. Go ahead and put on this cannon. Again, on his other arm. And you have this Starscream who looks much better in robot mode than he did in his alt mode. <laughs> And once again, we'll take a look at that head sculpt. The head sculpt isn't bad, but man, it looks mangled. Look at that. Orange eyes. Face isn't bad. It's a, I like the, the face sculpt. The helmet just looks raggedy. Like the, some serious mold degradation going on here or something. I don't know, but it's just, it's horrible. Um, but otherwise, the mold, it doesn't look bad in robot mode. It doesn't look too bad. Got some blue down here. It's not horrible, but, you know, standing next to these guys, pull this image back, and yeah, he doesn't like to stand straight, and he is a bit shorter than Megatron, as you can see, which scales I well together, I think, not so much that, those two, but 
as far as the two Bravo class ones, they scale together rather nicely, I think. Anyway, this has been my um, anyway, this has been my look at the Transformers Alpha and Bravo class Megatron and Bravo class Starscream. Pretty cool figures for what they are. So thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. Make sure you check out my playlist. Please uh, click that Patreon link below if you think you can help out the channel. I would much appreciate it. It goes a long way into continuing my channel. Got a lot of content coming up. Uh, um, many, many. I'm, I've got like 30 bots to review. Plus these tiny little vehicles. Look at those. Tiny little Bumby, Bumblebee. Tiny little Prime. And a super teeny tiny little Starscream. For example, look at... That's how tiny, teeny tiny they are. Pretty cool. Anyway, got those coming up. Once again, thanks for watching, thanks for listening, and uh, be good to each other.